Yo, so I'm gonna show you how to get rid of this damn message every time you're trying to do a lighthouse test. It's telling you that your results are gonna be skewed because of some index DB. Now it also tells you to open up your window in an incognito window, because that'll clear the cookies and cache and all of that, which it will, but in order to access the lighthouse tool, you need to navigate to the website, which fills that storage up again. So right here, this is what we're going to do. Head over to the application tab, and then I think it defaults to storage, but click on storage here on the left side, and then you wanna click clear site data. So we can see YouTube's a heavy app. It has 30 megabytes of data. Your website will probably have a lot less. Click clear website data. This should go down to zero. Go back over to the lighthouse tab, and that message should go away. If it doesn't, I recommend trying to close out the inspect tool element again, and then reopen it. It might come up again because, well, YouTube's just like trying to jam a bunch of stuff in here, but if you just close it out, you should be good to go. Uh, the message might come back up again, depending on the app, but your test won't be skewed as long as you, you clear this and you run the test. YouTube's a little bit unique because they are trying to, to stuff a lot of uh, storage and cookies and all of that on your browser, but that's gonna be how you get rid of that message so you can run a lighthouse test that's unskewed by previous visits to the website. If you're a web developer and interested in these types of tips, check out the channel, I'd love to have you. And uh, thanks for watching this video till the end, guys. I appreciate you and we'll catch you in the next one.